Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello students, how are you today? I hope we're always in a good and healthy condition Perkenalkan, saya Saila Shafifa Mulyani Or you can call me Miss Saila So today, we're gonna learn about Miss Island Text Jadi apa sih Miss Island Text itu? So let's check it out Before we jump to our material today, let's take a look at these learning objectives. First is, identify the social function, structure, and language feature of a news item text. Second, analyze the social function, structure, and language feature of a news item text. And third, make a news item text and present it to the class. So, without any further ado, let's start our class today. So, news item text is a text which informs readers about events of the day. The events are considered newsworthy or important. It means if there is an important event that should be known by many people, then this event deserves news. Seperti yang sudah dijelaskan sebelumnya bahwa news item text merupakan suatu bentuk teks yang berisi tentang informasi dari kejadian atau peristiwa penting dan tentunya dalam pembuatan news item text ada beberapa tujuan yang ingin dicapai seperti to inform readers about events of the day which are considered newsworthy or important to inform the readers about newsworthy or important events of the day and to present information to the readers about newsworthy or important events of the day For making a good news item text, we should know and understand about the generic structure of news item text. Now, let's take a look at this article. So, we're gonna learn, identify, and analyze the generic structure of news item text from this article. So, the first generic structure of news item text is main event. Main event juga dikenal dengan newsworthy event. Bagian ini adalah bagian yang menceritakan atau berisi berita mengenai peristiwa atau kejadian inti yang biasanya ditulis dalam bentuk ringkasan atau summary. And we can see from this article, this is the main event. And second part of news item text is elaboration. Elaboration juga dikenal sebagai background event. Elaboration merupakan bagian yang menceritakan latar belakang peristiwa atau kejadian, siapa yang terlibat, dan lokasi kejadian. And from this article, this is the elaboration. And the last part is resource of information. Resource of information merupakan bagian dari news item text yang menceritakan tentang komentar, saksi kejadian, pendapat para ahli, dan sebagainya mengenai peristiwa atau kejadian yang diberitakan. This is the resource of information from this article. For making a good news item text, we should consider about the language features of news item text. The first is focusing on circumstances by using a simple language in writing the text. Second, using saying verbs, for example, she said, they informed, he told, she reported. Third, sometimes at the beginning of news, the scene is mentioned. Fourth, Using past tense in explaining news events, but if it is a fact that until now still happened or still in the form of fact, then we can use simple present tense. Fifth, the telegraphic information about story captured in headline. Sixth, using adverbs like adverbs of time, adverbs of place, and adverbs of manner. And seven, using of material processes to retell the event. Nah, 
Nah, gimana materi hari ini? Menarik banget kan? Semoga teman-teman bisa mencerna dan mengaplikasikan materi hari ini di kehidupan sehari-hari ya. Hmm, sepertinya pertemuan kita cukup sampai di sini dulu. So, thank you so much for participating in my class today. Semoga kita bisa bertemu kembali di pertemuan berikutnya. See you next time. Bye. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.